only E3's patented closed loop system it enables you to both give you a clean energy source, energy independence, but also solves the methane emission, greenhouse gas effect, and the water pollution runoff effect, which is 70% of all water pollution in the U.S. It becomes uh, the best way to achieve energy independence. It's about 23 times more efficient than traditional ethanol and about 15 times more efficient than gasoline. Now we've patented this process and basically what it does is take three tried and true technologies uh, that have thousands of applications throughout the world independently and just put them together. E3 stands for Earth, Energy and Environment and it stands for the philosophy that you, we need to be having energy policies that are environmentally friendly and, and will protect the Mother Earth. Literally, the future of alternate energies is now. And what we've done with E3 and E3 Mead is the future is now, the future is here. And one of the neat, exciting things about this facility opening up is we can now demonstrate here's the future. Ethanol is ready to meet America's energy needs. It is already meeting a significant portion, and it can, it can probably by itself be the link that provides energy independence. This is the greatest source of economic development, not just for the ethanol facility, but for the livestock facility. Uh, so we're bringing back lots of jobs, thousands of jobs, to, uh, if not more, to rural America and revitalizing it. I think the, the, the closed-loop system that E3 is using is, is very interesting. Uh, the technologies are not new. Integrating them are new. And I, I think it holds a tremendous possibility uh, for revolutionizing the cattle feeding industry. I think all of this roll, rolled in with all of the issues we have with environment, uh, waste management. Uh, I just can't talk about how excited I am about the future of ethanol and cattle production together and what it could mean for Nebraska especially. The vast amount of research shows that ethanol production does create more energy than it consumes. The unique thing about E3 is without any fossil fuel inputs or very little fossil fuel input into the whole cycle, it really blows any uh, mention of uh, ethanol not being energy efficient out the door.